welcome to our Monday Minute. Today I'd like to talk to you about the PEPPER reports um, for both home health and hospice. Um, I want to begin by sharing a screen with you. Um, this is the PEPPER um, location for the actual PEPPER reports. Um, once you get to this website, you will scroll down uh, and select the one that you're here for. Um, this is hospice. Um, and if you go farther down, you'll be at home health. These PEPPER reports um, have been issued now for a few years. They're updated annually. Uh, for hospice, they're updated in April. For home health, they are updated in July. The PEPPER reports are very specific to detailed calculated targets that come from your claims data. Um, whether it's home health or hospice, Claims data is all that's used um, to calculate the targets. Um, when calculating the targets and they calculate the actual scores for your agencies, they are going to compare your scores to the 80th percentile of the nation. If your agency scores are higher than the 80th percentile of the nation, then there is a possibility that you could be targeted for additional medical review whether that's through ADRs or um, targeted probe and educate, which started again in September earlier this month, um, or whether it's a target by a UPIC auditor um, or the OIG. It is very, very important that you have reviewed your PEPA reports, again, whether you're home health or hospice, um, and ensure that someone within your organization is looking at any of your targeted scores that are in the 80th percentile or higher, or even approaching the 80th percentile to determine if there are things um, that can be done to avoid the scores being that high. You also want to take into account that again, all of these scores come from your claims data. And in some cases, especially with hospice, um, there may be things that are actually being done incorrectly on the claims that could trigger um, those targets to be calculated higher than they actually should be. So you're gonna want to take a look at those. Um, these PEPPER reports are being looked at at every review organization related to Medicare. So if you're not looking at them, everybody you don't want to look at them is, um, and it could definitely cause you problems. Um, there is a recent um, PEPPER report uh, or a PEPPER hospice PEPPER um, webinar uh, that was done by the National Association for Home Care and Hospice. And there is an upcoming one for home health PEPPER reports also through the National Home Care Association. And we will provide the link to that um, in our minute today. Thank you all for joining us today. Uh, we do appreciate um, always um, your attention uh, to the information that we provide. Um, as always, we encourage you to stay tuned in to your state and, and national home care associations um, and all of the data that they are there to provide. Also, there are things um, being sent out by the state and national association asking for your help in terms of advocacy with our representatives. Um, and we encourage you to participate in that fully. Uh, thank you again, and we will talk again soon.